First off, I'd like to congratulate all of you for making it to today. It's been a long couple of years, and I remember sitting in a similar chair two years ago for my high school graduation. A similar one where I had to listen to speakers give cliched speeches, and do you guys remember what it was like? Uh, you know, to have the speaker go on and on and on. Uh, the overused topics that were uh, put you to sleep after two minutes, I'm sure I could guess most of the quotes from your graduation speeches. How about, this isn't the end of the book, it's the beginning of a new chapter, or today is the first day of the rest of our lives, or the vague, go out and get it, well, get what? I don't get it. <laughs> I'll sit back and relax because this is not like any of those. I'm probably not like the typical student uh, or Mr. 4.0 that's typically up here talking and speaking in front of you. Uh, I've heard this little speech at uh, every band concert that I've been by Mr. Luth. Uh, stay involved. Don't, don't just go to uh, college and be in the books at all the times. Uh, uh, keep with your passion, whether it's music, sports, or whatever it is. Uh, I'm sure everybody's heard the quote from James Hallis Proverbs, all work and no play makes Shaq a dull boy. This quote simply means that you have to enjoy life a little now and then. My first semester here at Barton was spent with my nose in the books. Luckily in the spring semester of that year, I was brought into Campus Christian Fellowship and it has made a huge impact on my life. As far as importance, I've made friends. As far as importance, th th this is a close second. We've all worked hard to get to th this point right here, and some harder than others. Well, looking for a good quote, I, I found this while reading my Bible. It comes from Ecclesiastes 12.12. 12. Be warned, my son, of anything in addition to them, of making many books there is no end and much study wearies the body. I'll repeat that last part again. And much study wearies the body. I'm sure everyone has stayed up late because they've had to study. I know I have. Uh, I'd like to contribute my work ethic to golf. I started off playing really badly because I didn't pick up a golf club until I was a sophomore in high school. I've busted my butt every summer and every free second that I've had to get better. I had a goal when I was playing in high school I wanted a college golf bag. I walked onto the golf team this fall and I have my golf bag. The golf course has introduced me to a ton of amazing people and they will be a part of my life forever. While I'm up here, I would like to thank my mom for encouraging me to continue my education. I would also like to thank Mike Dawes for nominating me for this and the, thank you, Mike. Uh, I'd also like to thank the committee that chose me and interviewed me. And uh, when I found that I, uh, I had been selected, I kind of laughed at myself and I re remember this quote, the early bird might get the worm, but the second mouse gets the cheese. <laughs> Don't rush into things, stay smart, and please stay involved. At a community college, all it is is involvement. You could take a look at any group and see that people were involved in almost any activity they could be. So congratulations class of 2011 and goodbye.